Hey GED students, it's GED question of the daytime and I've got another little weird question. Again, this one's to help you visualize the concept of distribution. So let's take a look. It says examine the rectangle below. Its width is x plus 2 units and we can see they've marked it for us x plus 2 units, and look at the way they marked it. They're telling us that this part here is x, some unknown number we don't know, and this part here is those two units, see them, 1, 2. So it's x plus 2 wide. Its height is 4 units, so basically we see that x plus 2 repeating 4 times. And they want us to know what is the area of the rectangle. Uh, what will it take to cover this rectangle? Well, let's take a look. We've got these pieces in here. First of all, we have these x length pieces. See it? So this is an x. And because it's 4 high, I see that x happening 4 times. So there we have 4 of those x size pieces. 4 x's. In algebra, when we want to talk about four of some unknown thing, we just shove them real close together. Four x's, or four times x. Now let's look at the two units here. So I have the two units on the bottom row, one, two, uh, but notice that I do that four times. So there's three, four, five, six, and I'm not trying to mark those with an x. I was just checking them off, guys. Um, maybe that's confusing, actually. Let's use a different symbol. Those aren't the X's, those are the twos that I know. So we'll say one, two, there we go, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So there's eight um, little pieces. So I end up with the four X's and the eight little pieces. What's the area of this rectangle? It's four X plus eight. Now you might say, Kate, what in the crap does that have to do with distribution? Well, distribution is the idea that multiplication passes out over parentheses. If I have 4 times the quantity of x plus 2, I'll end up with 4 times x, or 4x, and 4 times positive 2, or positive plus 8. And here is a way to visualize that. Great. If you have any questions about this or any other GED math topic, be sure to drop it in the comments and I'll do my best to answer it.